The verse of light Arabic, eight and a Romanized, ayat and nur, is the 35th verse of the 24th surah of the Quran, surah and nur. The verse is renowned for its remarkable beauty and imagery, and perhaps more than any other verse lends itself to mystical or esoteric readings of the Quran. Verse Commentary Perhaps more than any other, this single ayat suggests only mystical interpretations, as the metaphor is completely coherent, but it does not surrender an obvious meaning. Hence it was and remains a key Quranic passage to many Sufis and Muslim philosophers into the present day, who argue for esoteric readings of the Quran. Most noteworthy amongst the intellectual and spiritual geniuses who have puzzled over Ayat and Nur is Al-Ghazali whose reflections on this verse, as well as the nature of divine light is collected in his masterpiece Mishkat al-Anwar Often employed by Sufis and Muslim philosophers, the light verse testifies of God as the "...light of the heavens and the earth". The short metaphor which follows, is both visual enough to be grasped by anyone, and yet suggests realms of meaning beyond any literal reading of the book. This verse is also the primary source of one of the 99 names of God, an nur, and the light. Commentators on Ayat and Nur include Avicenna Al-Ghazali Faq al-Din al-Razi Ibn al-Arabi Rumi Mullah Sadra Hakim Nur Uddin Mirza Bashir Uddin Mahmud Ahmad Ibn Qayyim al jortia See also Ayat Ayat al-Kursi Esoteric interpretation of the Quran Esotericism Nur Islam Sufism Sufi texts Surat al-Nur Further reading Boering, Gerhard The Light Verse, Quranic Text and Sufi Interpretation External links Theophanes and Lights in the Thought of Ibn Arabi Al-Ghazali. Mishkat al-Anwar The Niche for Lights here chapter Nur on Islamicity Surah Nur Holy Quran Light upon Light Islamic videos Hakikarul Furkan Tafsir of Maulana Hakim Nur Uddin Summary of Ibn Qayyim Tafsir of Ayat Nur